to actually type this particular keyword on Google search, Cosmit AI review. As you can see, Google site is actually ranking in the first page of Google. And when we click on it, you are going to see that this particular product, they're actually promoting affiliate products. I'm able to rank it on Google Search Console. So in today's video, I'll be showing you exactly how I can rank this kind of article within 24 hours. I'm, I'm very sure that you are going to get it ranked within 24 hours. So I actually make a video about how you can set up the landing page very similar to this and be able to write a product review using AI. So I'm going to drop the link of the video inside the video description for you to watch and learn. So this is a follow-up of the previous video about how you can promote products on JVZoo. So now that I have the content already, so I actually want to run this content on Google search within 24 hours. So and for you to do that, it's very, very simple. So I'm going to show you the step-by-step -step guide. This is the home page of Google site. I, I believe that you have a Google site already that you actually want to add to Google search console and Google analytics. So for you to do that is very, very simple. So the first thing you have to do is to ensure that the email you use to sign up for Google search console is the same thing with Google uh, site. So both of the email must be corresponding, including the Google search console, the Google analytics and Google site so the three email must you must use one single email to register those three accounts so that it will be able to connect successfully so the next thing is to actually copy your uh, google search console uh, url so i'm going to copy the google search console url copy then come over to google search console so we are going to add this particular website to google search console so i'm going to actually maybe type in f because i have a lot of website i've added to this platform so i'm going to click on add property so there are two options for you to actually add your website to google search console you can add domain name which is new that have just been added but we don't really want this because it's like we don't have a domain name we are using google third party website so we are going to use url prefix to actually add our google search console i mean google site to google search console we are going to paste the domain name over here which is the domain name i mean the website url of our product we are going to click on continue so it's going to verify but we are not going to get the confirmation very easily a lot of people actually stuck in this process trying to verify their uh, media property on google search console but they can't due to the fact that there are a lot of settings you have to do so as you can see, this is the next thing you have to do now. As you can see, they have three options. I mean, like four or three. So you can actually upload this uh, code to your footer of your website. You can use HTML tag. You can use Google Analysis. But the problem with this method is because we don't have access to Google site because Google site is owned by Google itself and we don't have a hosting. So the possible way, the fastest way to do it is to use Google's Analytics to actually achieve it. So we are going to, the next thing we have to do now is to go to Google Analytics, then actually add our website to Google Analytics to be able to achieve it. So as you can see, this is Google Analytics. So I'm going to actually click on it to actually show you exactly how you can add your Google, uh, add your website to Google Analytics. So, oh, okay, it's a mistake, Abby. So, oh, sorry. So, Google Analytics. I'm going to go to the official website. So, okay, it's loading up. It's loading up right now. So this is Google Analytics. So all we have to do is to add another property on Google Analytics. So I'm going to click on admin. So admin, then I'm going to add a property on Google Analytics. Then I'm going to click on create a property. So I'm going to click on create a property. So we know we have already copied our URL. So let me call the URL Cosmit. Okay, I'm going to copy the let me go back to Google Analytics. So this is our URL and we're actually promoting Cosmit AI. So I'm going to copy Cosmit AI, come to Google Analytics, then actually name it as Cosmit.ai. So the next thing is to uh, click on next. So and it's going to ask me for this particular question. What is the domain name is all about so i think we are going to choose technology so you can actually choose any niche like let's say computer and electronics then you have to choose uh, your business size which is small business because we are the only one operating the website so as you can see they are going to ask you some questions like generating lead drive online sales so you know we are just starting out we can choose any of this one that we want it's not really necessary so i'm going to create then 
waiting for the next thing to do. So as you can see, commission here has been created. So the most important aspect you have to get now is actually choosing the platform. Is it a website? Is it a Android app? Is it iOS? So well, obviously, we are actually working towards a website. So I'm going to choose website option. So and go back to our website, which is uh, the landing page we created with google site i'm going to copy the landing page then come over to google analytics so paste the url obviously you are going to remove the HT, uh, http because we have https already so i'm going to remove it then like you uh, remove the slash then actually uh, name it as Cosmet ai so i'm going to copy Cosmet ai then paste it over here so we are going to create the stream so we are going to click on create the stream and we are about to actually get our website verified on Google Analytics. So we are good to go. So the next thing we have to do now that because we have already created our Google Analytics. So we are going to copy this measurement ID. So copy the measurement ID to actually install it to, okay, we can tell it to install it manually or using CMS, but we don't really want that. All we have to do is to copy this measurement ID copy then the next thing we have to do now to actually make sure we verify our identity on google search console is to go back to our uh, dashboard of google site i'm very sorry google site i'm going to go back to the dashboard so because you know we already have this website and this is in land this is the home page of the website when we click on it so we are going to go back to the interface the dashboard then go back to go over to settings so we are going to click on you are going to see analysis over there so analysis and we are going to paste the measurement id we copy from google analysis so as you can see this is the measurement id for google analysis i will go back we are going to uh google search i mean google analysis we are going to paste the measurement id so we are going to go so all we have to do is to click on publish so as you can see google analysis is now active on our google search console uh, google site so the next thing we have to do is to go back to uh, this particular google search console to verify that we added our google analytics onto our google search uh, google site so i'm going to click on google site option then click on verify so as you can see it's going to take a while for us to verify it and we are going to go as you can see uh, ownership verified so we are good to go so let me click on the go to property as you can see this particular property has been added to google search console and for we to actually test that it is working perfectly we can actually copy the url of our uh, landing page for google site copy the url come over to google search console then we are going to request for indexing for us to actually get indexing within 24 hours i'm very sure i've used this method to actually verify most of my Google site and rank faster. So I'm going to test the live URL to see if we are going to run for this website or not. So it's testing the URL. It's going to take a while for it to test. And you know, I've been doing this video. If you like this video, please ensure you give me thumbs up. And if you have any question, like maybe related to affiliate marketing, let me know. I'm actually open to respond to any query or any question. So it's going to take a while for it to load. So as you can see, your URL is now available to Google. So that means we have actually linked our Google uh, site to Google Search Console and Google Analytics. So it's very, very simple. All you have to do is to follow the tutorial I've showed you in this video. So I'm going to request for indexing for this particular landing page, Cosmet AI to be indexed and be able to make commission so as you can see indexing requested that means we can actually index this website within 24 hours and we are going to see uh, when we search for okay let's go back to google and we search for a uh, cosmic ai review so when we search for cosmic ai review we are going to see our website either in the first page of google or we are going to see that we started creating traffic instantly or like you just leaving it hoping that google is going to pick up your website and start ranking it's my google might not even discover it at all but using this method i've showed you there's high probability that your website might be added to google search console and start getting traffic to your google site so i hope this video actually help you so if you if this video help you out please ensure you give me a thumbs up like subscribe to this channel because it will encourage me to produce more content like this and if i see something that is working right now i will actually go on my screen record it and show you step by step guide to do it thanks for watching this video i will see you in my next video bye